Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice algebra equation? Finding the value of x. From here, we have 3 raised to the power x plus 3 raised to the power x plus 1, then plus 3 raised to the power x minus 1 equals to 39. Let's rearrange this and write 3 raised to the power x minus 1 first. So this becomes 3 raised to the power x minus 1, then plus 3 raised to the power x plus 3 raised to the power x plus 1 equals to 39. And from here, let's make x minus 1 in the power to be common, and we can write raised to the power x here again, and also we can write x plus 1 again in term of x minus 1. So we have 3 raised to the power x minus 1, then plus 3 raised to the power x minus 1, then plus 1. Minus 1 plus 1 is 0, so we still have 3 raised to the power x. Then from here as well, we have plus 3 raised to the power x minus 1, then plus 2. Minus 1 plus 2 will still give us x plus 1, which is equal to 39. And from here, we can use the law of indices here. And uh, this plus 1 can be written as 10 to the power 1. So we have 3 to the power x minus 1 plus 3 to the power x minus 1 times 3 to the power 1. Then plus 3 raised to the power x minus 1 times 3 raised to the power 2, which is equal to 39. And uh, in the next step, we have 3 raised to the power x minus 1 common. When we factor it out, we have 3 raised to the power x minus 1 out. Then what is left here is 1. Then plus, taking this out, what is left here is 3 raised to the power 1 plus, here we have 3 raised to the power 2, then equals to 39. And from here, we simplify what we have inside here. We have 3 to the power x minus 1 into bracket 1 plus 3 plus 9. We have 3 raised to the power 1 is 3. 3 squared is 3 times 3, that's 9, equals to 39. And when we add this together, we have 13. So this is 3 raised to the power x minus 1 times 13 equals to 39. Then divide both sides by 13. And 13, we cancel each other here. So 39 divided by 13, that's 3. So we have 3 raised to the power x minus 1 equals to 3. And also, it can be written as 3 raised to the power 1. And the base are the same thing. Then we can equate the power. Then we have x minus 1 equals to 1. Take minus 1 here, become plus. That means we have x equals to 1 plus 1. Therefore, x equals to 2 from here. Then, to verify, to check what's from what you are given, we have 3 raised to the power x plus 3 raised to the power x plus 1 plus 3 raised to the power x minus 1 equals to 39. Now, let's put x equals to 2 from here. Then, this becomes 3 square. That is x equals to 2 plus 3 raised to the power 2 plus 1. x is 2. That's 3 here. Then plus 3 raised to the power x minus 1. That's 2 minus 1. That's 3 raised to the power 1. Is equals to 39. And from here, we have 3 squared to be 9. Plus 3 cubed. That's 3 times 3 times 3. That's 27. Then plus 3. Is equal to 39 and from here when we add this up we have 27 plus 3 30 30 plus 9 that's 39 equals to 39 so the left hand side equals to right hand side then we can say that s equals to 2 is a solution to this problem thank you for watching please share this video subscribe to my channel give it a thumbs up turn the notification bell on in order not to miss out see you next class and bye for now